Hello everyone and welcome to part 5 of setting up your recruitment agency. Now in my last video I talked about setting up the domain name servers to put the site live um, on the internet. So what I want to do in this video, once you've logged in to your WordPress and this is how you log in, it will be wp-admin you'll be sent an email with your password. Once you log in, the site is not live at the moment. Now what it looks like, it will have a come in soon section that you can obviously edit if you like. Um, so this is what the website will look like but when you're logged in. So it's very simple, there's nothing on it at the moment. I'm going to show you how to customize it to suit your what, whatever your requirements are. So we're going to go ahead and launch the site at the moment. And once we've done that we're going to add a theme. Now a theme will be under appearances, theme, and these are the sort of default ones. Now we can click I believe it's upload and then we can search for a theme so we might type in recruitment and what this does it's got a catalog of free themes you can just click and install so if we go ahead and let's search staffing maybe because these are mainly made for the American market so we can just look at jobs see what comes up if we like any now these can be changed very easily so we're going to go ahead and let's try this one see how it looks if it's any good we'll, we'll leave it and we'll customize it shortly now this is totally up to you you can buy a premium theme so we're just going to look how it looks like um, and then we can assign widgets after this so everything is pretty much drag and drop so we may go back and have a look at the previous one because these will allow you to add jobs so WordPress job manager it comes you know all loaded in so all you do is you click install let's just do this for an example and see how it looks and if we can get it up and running so <coughs> excuse me so this is obviously in real time so I don't exactly want to do it you know before and after I want to show you everything because you're going to be doing this as well and once you're once you've installed it you want to highlight them all and you want to click um, activate and this will make all the plugins live a plugin is basically think of it as an app for your websites so it has all different features some will just you know put a little phone number up there and let's have a look and what we want to do is we want to go to customize and this will give you a live preview on the side and here what your website will look like let's see what we look like once it loads and it's there's a ton of videos on here um, online so you can always watch and you can always edit WordPress is very good because it's very customizable and the other thing you can do if you want to make an investment into this let's see theme options nope so home page settings so we can pick a static no, there's nothing built in so what we can do is we can customize this from the customize section so you can put if we just add UK it will show up here and you can click publish after that to assign a menu I'll show you that in a second so the menu section is here and we can add home and click primary and what that does is create a menu so we can go manage jobs from here as well and um, sample page we can take that off and then we can add whatever we like so we can have a URL which could be TPS nanozo.co.uk forward slash jobs and that will bring you to your job section and it will say search jobs you can add to the menu and what I should do it should have a search jobs bit there and when someone clicks it so it's very simple to add um, the link isn't set up because I don't have a page um, I don't want to show you too too much but this is pretty much how the website will look I'm gonna spend time I don't want to ramble on and then start messing about with everything um, if you do want to 
buy a theme that you can just click and install and it'll be already set up we can look at um, staffing agency WordPress theme and you can search free it as well and you can see what comes up um, from there so we can just click one of these have a little look and see um, what we kind of pick up so these are sort of the themes you'll be looking at and um, some of them have very nice features and you can go ahead and purchase any of those I use theme forest mainly when I'm searching and um, because you know it's it's good quality you can see all the reviews and yeah so we can have a look at this it was got very bad reviews let's see if there's any good ones let's have a look at it sixty dollars I may look at purchasing one but I may set up one so this is how it would be so this is this is how you can actually most of the stuff you can edit yourself and um, from here and yeah so I hope that helped I hope you can get set up any questions if you want to jump on a call and have a chat um, about setting up a website if you find a good free theme let us all know as well and um, we'll take it from there spend about an hour on the website you can chop and change very easily from the admin panel and it's not too complicated I don't know any coding you don't have to know anything um, associated with it and um, just to add a job as well it, it comes in with one of those WordPress manager plugins and you can add a job has the company logo job type um, location you know etc and I think there should be a salary section um, somewhere as well so you can add jobs onto your website with that plugin as well which is called WordPress WordPress job manager so download that and you can drag and drop that in and um, this is a free plugin but there's some paid features as well but it's all you need to start adding jobs to your website as well so it can be like a job board and when people search so you're gonna need that that's the basic function so yeah hope that helped and um, hopefully we'll get into the juicy stuff where we'll start to once the website is set up we're gonna probably set up an email address and then start discussing how we're gonna approach business development and winning new clients so hope that helped let me know if you've got any questions